I believe I've done myself in. And now the two of you have betrayed me at once. Know what betrayal means, Bertram? No. It means hurting me, Audrey. Well, I thought you liked me. I've clothed you. I fed you. Bertram does like Miss Marjorie. Yeah. And Miss Marjorie likes Bertram. So why don't you go and tell me where that little Magnifico has run off to? Get on with weapon that's not nose running to shape. He owes me. He owes us. Big time. Bertram and Marjorie. Would Bertram like a shit? Like Sherry. <laughs> yes, he does. <laughs> Everything okay? Imagine saving people, Hotel. taking them to your breast. Oh. Metaphorically, I mean, like a mother, caring and raising them. And then they go and stab you in the back. Have you ever betrayed a close friend? I hope not. Uh. Treachery. And these are sad, low, unlovable people. And I made them stop. Dreamers, entertainers, and they... Oh, no, now family's not enough. No, no, he's gone off alone. My little no. tiny magician has gone and stabbed his mom on the back. No. Oh, fuck it, he... No, Bertram, Bertram, Bertram! Woof, woof, Bertram! Put the nice man down! Do something, you only eat him! Um, uh, easy there. Easy there! Bertram! Easy, big guy. Bertram! <laughs> There's no putting this off. Get You're a naughty boy. How you like that? Easy, Easy boy. He's strong, all right. Come here, Bertram. <laughs> oh, yes, Marjorie's here. No one's gonna hurt you ever again. Mama, you should keep that thing in a cage. Maybe you should think about who you're serving. Give me a beer, will you? Don't worry, we'll pay for what we broke. Come here, Bertram. Oh, no one looks after you like Mama does. No one cares for you like I do. Especially not that Magnifico, hmm? But he's my friend. Yes, well, if he were your friend, he'd be here, wouldn't he? He wouldn't have abandoned us. Oh, you wouldn't have gotten that whoopsie, would you? Whoopsie heart. I know. Mama's gonna make it all better. But first, you gotta tell me where that little worm ran off to, hmm? Bertram promise. Yes, well, Magnifico made a promise, too, huh? He made more than a promise. He made a contract, and he broke it. So you just tell me exactly where he is, and then we will all be even. That's my boy. He's camping in the woods. Why didn't you tell me in the first place? You just apologize to these men. I'm sorry. Yeah. I'm sorry. You gave me a whoopsie. You just stay away from that Sherry, you hear? Bertram likes Sherry. Oh, don't you get him started. Thank you for all of your help, Mr. Stranger. If you see that slippery little fella sleeping rough out there, would you just make a little racket and then we'll come along and we'll find you? I could try. Oh, his name is Magnifico. You'll know him when you see him. Come along, Bertram. Shit. I ain't never thought no 
Mister? Just thinking. Maybe our problems aren't all that bad, huh? Have a good one. Why is everything moving? Easy. Mister?
That's amazing. If you say so. Are you, oh, are you Magnifico by any chance? I'm not going back. She's a witch. She's a witch. Who? Presta. Marjorie. She cares about you a lot. Well, I'm the talent. It's me. It's all me. I share the money with her and, uh, you know, that thing. No, stay away. You've made love to her, haven't you? That's not it. She's a succubus. She's a succubus. Ah! Stay away from me. Hey, partner. Come back here. What the hell? We're gone. Look, you got the wrong end of this. Nothing ain't solving anything. Can't magic. This partner. Come on now. She ain't as bad as all that. Over here, dummy. And you led me on a merry old dance. Come on down. Lady said you had a contract. You want me? Come and get me. <laughs> hey, hold on there. Not so Damn long, it. dummy. Where are you? You little. Ah, no! 
damn it! Ah! Oh! Oh! That butt! Oh no! 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 Oh, 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 no! I can't! Oh, oh, no! 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 Put me down! I ain't back! I'm gone! On the next train to the Great White Way! Really? You got enough for a ticket? Pa. Because the way Big Fanny tells it, you spent all of our takings on a case of the French pox. Maybe I did. So what? What do you need a stump of a showman for? Same bad jokes? The same cheap tricks? In a package half the size? You got Bertram. You got Dummy over there. Who is Dummy anyway? The missing link? <laughs> oh, <laughs> shut up, you dimwit. You sold me out. You should watch your mouth. You don't need me. You're better off without me. Even you, dummy. Go on, clear off. Aim for the top, all of you. I'm out of food and I'm out of ideas. Leave me for the bears. I won't be more than a mouthful. You robbed me. Whoa. You robbed your brother. So you are going to be pulling rabbits out of your ass until you are as old as you are tiny. Put them up there. Ah, oh, some friends, some friends. We ain't friends. No. We're family, as much as it pains me to say it. Family? Still after everything? Well, of course, you silly little man. And him? Let him at the bar agree to help. Ah, sleeping rough don't suit me much. I uh, know. Come to Mama. Oh, I did miss you. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Now, don't you ever run off on us like that again. Back together! Back together! Well, I'm glad everything worked out. Thanks to you. Thank him, boys. Thank you! Uh, thanks for nothing, dummy. No get in the back. We ought to give you a piece of the gate on our next show. You earned it. Huh? We'll be playing Saint Denis next. Check with the box office. Here! No one said anything about splitting the gate. Oh, shut up. Half man and half wit. Bye bye. What I done to deserve you too? Let's go, girl.